Hey, what's going on ladies and gentlemen? How are you people doing here? Back again with another YouTube video here. So today I will be talking to you about the case of Danilo Cavalcante. That's right, because if you people have been watching the news uh, recently, Danilo Cavalcante, a, uh, a person who, you know, just uh, I guess uh, a few days after he was sentenced to life in prison without parole for basically unaliving his girlfriend in front of her kids. That's right. So it just goes to show you here that what he did was not only unforgivable, but this guy is just a literal monster. There's no other way to say this. And apparently he's also wanted for a uh, homicide in Brazil in 2017. And, you know, there's footage of him escaping a the Pennsylvania prison. Basically, what he did was that he scaled a wall with his arms and with his feet as if he was, you know, trying to do his best Spider-Man impression. That's right. Uh, there is video footage of that. And the biggest thing that surprises me the most is how come that wall wasn't like sealed off with concrete or with barbed wire. And I guess you could say this is another case of a correctional officer or the correctional staff just failing to do their jobs properly. So basically, the suspect here remains at large. But eventually, I think he's going to get caught just because i don't think he's going to be able to get away with this for so long but yeah um basically uh, a convict escaped from prison and now he's uh, wanted at large and all that and you know in my honest opinion um i just feel like that when it comes to uh, prison security i think they need to do a way better job especially you know to prevent escapes like this because i imagine that this is not going to look good especially for the prison warden and you know i'm um, just wondering like is anybody going to be held responsible for his escape or no because that's one of the biggest things i always wonder is besides you know me wondering if he's going to get caught is if if any of the correctional staff is going to get fired because of this because i mean you know this does not look good for the prison especially you know considering that he uh, manages to escape just like that without being detected is crazy because whenever i watch prison documentaries you know they always have barbed wire fences and they always have uh you know guard towers on like each corner i guess by the um by the uh, barbed wire fences and just for him just to escape like that undetected is absolutely crazy and wild but um yeah i think that he's eventually going to get caught but if there's one thing i also want to say is that if you live in the pennsylvania area you know if you live near anywhere that's a prison the only thing i want to say is stay safe and uh, be vigilant because obviously um this guy obviously you know, he's wanted for a good reason. So that's all I got to say. Peace.